And I'm Dave, one of the new millennial renters. And for ages I haven't been able to get my own place. Certainly not within London, but now, just outside of London, I have managed to find somewhere to live. I'm going to show you it. Here it is. £500 a calendar month. Shall I show you into my abode? I'm sorry, I should have tidied up. But let's go inside. I'll tell you one advantage though. As it is, as you can see, a phone box converted into what they have, have described it as the estate agents as to me, maybe a little bit misleading, I don't know, as a studio flat. I didn't have to put a phone in. This is a working phone line, but I do have to pay as you go my phone bills, as you can imagine. 60p is the minimum charge, and that's just to ring my mum. But I don't get a paper phone bill. I don't at the end of the month. I can easily afford it because I know what I'm spending on my phone bills. Uh, there was internet, but that was three pound a minute because that was the old uh, phone box scheme. I couldn't do anything about that, so I just used my mobile for that. Calls are cheaper on my mobile as well, so I still use my mobile. But it is a great place. Uh, I uh, perfected the art of sleeping standing up. I'll show you how I do it. Pretend it's late at night, um, which is usually about one or two because that's all the noise going past. People going out the pubs, people shouting things like, Oh, you saddo, Dave! Outside, for example, stops me going to sleep. I just do this. Oh, yeah, that is relaxing. Brilliant. I love having your own place and somewhere to sleep. Isn't it brilliant? I love that. I wake up absolutely refreshed. And I go to work to afford this place. So I have to go out my front door, which is right by my bed. So convenient. The mail just drops onto the floor and... It couldn't be a more simple way to live. I'd recommend the phone box life to anyone who can't afford anywhere else. 